Ooh, that is cold. Good morning, guys. Welcome. Thank you for joining me this morning on this beautiful but very chilly Good Friday morning here in Michigan. I got a few errands to run, and I wanted to get them done early. I thought I might bring you along. But before I left, I walked out to the mailbox, and guess what I found? Go ahead, guess. Florida Tackle Club for March 2021. Guys, I am stoked to open this box. I cannot wait to show you what's inside. So, let me go run my errands. I'm going to take my baby over and get it washed. And then i got to stop off at the hardware and pick up a few things. And then we'll get back here. We'll get down into the cave. And then we will look inside this box and see what it's all about. I cannot wait, so stay tuned. Welcome back to No Redemption Outdoors, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for joining me today on this Good Friday morning. I appreciate you taking time out of your uh, holiday weekend to spend here. And yes, we finally made it back to the cave where it's nice and cozy and warm. This morning when I walked out the door, it was 18 degrees. And that, <laughs> that was a bit of a surprise, I will tell you. However, my spirits are not dampened by the cold. Uh, it is still spring, no matter what the temperature may say, it is still spring, and they're telling us that this weekend, and uh, Easter Sunday in particular, we're going to get over 70 degrees, and it'll be beautiful and sunny, so you know what? Nothing's going to get me down, and especially when the first thing that happens today is I walk out to my mailbox, and what do I see but Florida Tackle Club. Uh, what a pleasant surprise, and if you guys know Florida Tackle Club, uh, then you know why I'm so excited, and if you don't, well, you're about to find out. Before we get started, though, I want to draw your attention to the link up above. That is our three-minute grab bag giveaway. I have a giant duffel bag filled with dozens of baits that I've accumulated over time, and I reach in every Saturday morning, grab one out at random, and we give it away. It's really simple to win. All you have to do is subscribe and comment. And, of course, come back every Saturday and find out if you are the big winner. And this week's bait we'll be giving away is the uh, Vicious MC65. Could be your turn, so make sure you stop by Saturday morning, 9 a.m. We will see. All right. Now, let's talk about Florida Tackle Club. Um, this box comes every other month. Now, this happens to be the Southern Angler. That is a higher tier box, and it's $50. And as I mentioned, it comes every other month. So this is my second official box. I will put a link up above for my first box opening I did with them. And I was very pleased and impressed. Uh, the thing that's special about Florida Tackle Club is the way that they, they tailor the box to you as an individual. They personalize it. So when you sign up, you give them certain information about yourself, your preferences, your location, uh, what kind of waters you fish, etc. Uh, oftentimes, Vic, the owner of the company, will actually call you and chat with you so he can learn more about you and then really dial in his selection of baits for you. So I didn't get to talk to Vic personally, but I will tell you he's done a great job uh, thus far in uh, really understanding what I like as a fisherman. Uh, as I always do, I went through this box and did... Um, research on each of the baits, put together my notes. I will sh share with you as a bit of a humorous side note that um, once I got all the baits out of this box that's, you know, very, very packed, I had the hardest time getting them back in there so I could do this video. It was like a puzzle, but, you know, it just goes to show how jam-packed this box is. So uh, let's go ahead and get started. Uh, first thing we're going to do is the one minute what's in it. Uh, we'll roll into, after that, the next segment where we look at each bait individually and talk about their pricing and so forth. And then at the end, we'll do our value analysis. So uh, let's go ahead and jump in here. And like always, I'm going to give you the first look. And right on the top is a handwritten note, and this is in every box that goes out from Florida Tackle Club. So, you know, Vic, I'll go ahead and let you take a look at that. But Vic writes this in uh, every box, and I have to tell you that, that is a very impressive thing to me, that very, very personalized service. 
All right, in no particular order, as you can see, I've already opened this one once. This is the KVD Splash, this top water popper. All right. Next, we have Walleye Assassin. Uh, this is a six pack. Little Boss is the name of the bait. And I believe this is the color Boudreaux. Next, we have uh, Must Add Addicted Walleye Death Spinner. This is a uh, crawler harness. For you walleye fishermen. And then we have a package of uh, mushroom jig heads from Hyperlastics, three pack. All right. And then right under that, and I believe meant to go with it, is this package of uh, Hyperlastics worm stick. These are five and a half inch. The color on these is watermelon red. All right. And then we have this item from Spool Tech. This is the Fatty 5 inch. Color on this is bluegill. Next, we have the Live Target Rainbow Smelt. Color on this is silver bronze. Okay. Then we have another uh, crawler harness. This is uh, Walleye Delight. I think the color is rainbow. Right. And then we have the uh, fishing or mission fishing jerk bait jerk bait hooks, three pack, three yacht. And then we have a couple stickers here. We have the Florida Tackle Club sticker that is as big as my hand. And then we have a Mission Fishing Lure Company sticker. Very cool. All right. That is the one minute what's in it. Uh, now, let's take a look at each of the baits individually. And as I mentioned, I've got my notes here. And so we're going to go in order of my notes. Uh, I'm going to set this box aside. All right. So the first thing we're going to look at is this spool tech, uh, the fatty five inch. All right. And this is a very interesting bait. Uh, I can't decide if it's a gimmick or if it's legit. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and open it up while I tell you about it. This um, was originally designed uh, for snook fishermen. Uh, there was a, uh, whoever originally designed this came up with this idea specifically for snook fishing, and then they realized it was such a success that they then developed baits for other species of fish. This one happens to be uh, presumably for bass. Uh, it's a hard body swim bait with a replaceable tail. It's made of what they call soft, tough plastic. So that is a proprietary plastic. What's unique about this bait is that it has the main hook here is attached to a leader which is attached to a, re a retractable spool. So when you get your hook up, it will break away on this leader and that's prevent the fish from using the weight, the weight of the bait itself as leverage to throw the hook. This will helpfully, hopefully increase your hookup rate. And, you know, then once you uh, finish, unhook the fish, then you just retract it back up by turning this dial here. Hopefully you can see that dial. And as I turn it, it reels it back in, and then you just reset the whole thing, and you're ready to go again. All right. So it's an interesting concept. Again, I'm not sure whether I regard it as legit or whether it's gimmicky, but I will tell you that I think I will have a lot of fun trying it out for sure. Hopefully we'll catch a fish and prove the technology. Um, this is going for $17.99, guys. So this is not an inexpensive bait. All right. So that is the Spool Tech Fatty 5-inch. In bluegill, seventeen dollars and ninety-nine cents. All right. Next item is let me get these stickers out of the way. Next item is the KVD Splash. All right, and as you can see, I've had this opened. Uh, let me go ahead and open it up again. Yes, I did film once before. All right, as you can see, this is a top water popper. It's got the feather tail. Uh, 3D eyes, BMC, black nickel hooks. All right, this is a great uh, topwater walking popper. 
I might fish this a little bit later in the season. Probably not right now, but uh, soon. All right. Did I mention the color? I think I did. Chrome blue. Smoky chrome blue. All right. And this is going for $7.49. All right. So that's the KVD Splash Topwater Pop. Uh, did I mention half ounce and three inches? I meant to. All right. Carrying on. Next item is the Walleye Assassin, these soft plastics here, Walleye Assassin Little Boss. These are three and a half inch, a six pack. Let me get one out. As I mentioned, I believe the color here is Boudreaux. I believe that's the color. I'll give you a look at it here. So this is a paddle tail, obviously. It's got a worm, or I'm sorry, a hook slot in the top and in the bottom. As you can see, it's got the ribbed body, so that creates a lot more turbulence and bubbles and so forth so forth in the water. Uh, it's great as a swim bait on a swim bait hook, a rig, um, spinner bait trailer. These are all the ways they recommend it and I could see that. So there you have it. That is the uh, Walleye Assassin Little Boss six pack, five dollars and forty nine cents. Okay. All right, next turn my page. We have the uh, Hyperlastics Worm Stick. This is a five and a half inch. Color on this is watermelon red. I'm going to show you this on the back here. It's very important. Um, I'll bounce back to that in a second. Let me get one out. All right. This is made with a uh, highly buoyant uh, plastic. I'll show you that in one second. Uh, the tail is a bit bulbous and the uh, design purpose here is that when it's sinking that and especially when it gets to the bottom on it, let's say a jig head, that tail is going to float vertical. All right? that, it's got a bit of, like I say, a bulbous tail there. The, the uh, plastic is what they call uh, soft, tough, soft, tough plastic. So it's the same stuff as that, uh, it's made from the same stuff as this. All right. Now, what's interesting about this worm stick is it's got pre-positioned holes and slots running the length of the worm, and they call that their keepers and hole system. And that means that, uh, and that's where the back of this comes in, as I was referencing, it shows you, depending on how you want to fish this and which hook you want to use, where to place the hook in these pre-positioned holes and slots. And hopefully you can see that, although I imagine it's not easy, but again, there are various holes and slots where you would place the hook. So that's a very interesting concept. Um, and then I think going with this, and by the way, that's $7.49 for this five pack. But to go with that is this three pack of mushroom jig heads. These are 3 16 ounce. And so again, if you look at the back of this, it does show you how to use this particular hook. It tells you where to put it and how to place it in, in the holes and so forth. So uh, we're definitely going to try that out. They have what they call an inverse hook, inverse hook design. I'll be honest, I don't even know what that means. I tried to understand that, but I couldn't. So if any of you guys know, drop a comment down below. Again, I'm not sure exactly what that's all about. But there you go. That is the Hyperlastics Mushroom Jig Head, $6.49 for a three-pack. That is meant to go together with these hyperelastic worm sticks. They're seven dollars forty-nine cents. All right. Next item is the Live Target Rainbow Smelt. This looks very interesting to me. This will catch pike. Uh, I'm sure it's meant to catch bass, but this will catch pike. I guarantee it. Uh, let me get get this out. This uh, dives seven to nine feet. The color on this is uh, silver bronze. They, um, they claim it's designed for walleye, trout, and salmon. So right away what comes to my mind is heading up to the St. Mary's River, up Sault Ste. Marie. That's where we go all the time. This would be great there. If we're going to go after walleye, trout, and salmon, all of them are, are there in that fishery. So be interesting. But I, like I say, I know this will catch pike as well. Uh, and I imagine bass. So 
what else can I tell you about this? This, uh, oh, rattle chamber. It does have a rattle chamber and weight transfer. Let me see if you can hear it. So, again, the weight transfer system allows for longer casting. The rattle allows for the uh, noise in the water. All right. So that is the uh, Live Target Rainbow Smelt. This is a four and a half inch and five eighths ounce, twelve dollars and ninety nine cents. All right. The next item is this Mustad Addicted Walleye Death Spinner. Now this is um, a crawler harness, but you can also put soft plastics on there. Let's go ahead and open it up. This is a uh, one quarter ounce. Let's see if I can get it out of there without destroying the package. I don't think I can. So here we go. Um, quarter ounce. The color on this is Lime Truce. All right, there. <laughs> Shall I put it in the grab bag, guys? All right, let's take a look at this thing. All right, so as you can see, it's got the propeller. And it's got this little stinger hook on the end there. So whatever you rig up on there, you can bury the stinger hook on the end. And that way, if it short strikes, you're going to have a better chance of uh, getting the fish. Uh, I would probably put a, a plastic worm on there or even a live night crawler even. And, uh, of course, the spinner there will give uh, the little propeller there will give a little bit of flash. All right. It does have two eyelets on it, so you can fish it either vertically you can jig it if you rig it on top, or you can rig it on the nose there and then swim it. All right. Let's see what else we can tell you here. It's got an ultra point hook on there, three yacht. That does not look like a three yacht to me, I'll be honest. So there you have it. That is the uh, Mustad Addicted Walleye Death Spinner, $3.59. All right. So much for that package. Uh, next item is the Mission Fishing Jerk Bait Hooks. Right here. Let's go ahead and get one out. This is, as I mentioned, 16th ounce with uh, let's see here, 3 out black nickel hook, 16th out weight, uh, screw keeper on there. Uh, stainless steel, by the way. This is best used with three to seven inch soft plastics, according to uh, the maker. And you can rig this up, make it nice and weedless. All right. That is a um, three pack going for $4.99, the Mission Fishing Jerkbait Hooks. All right. And then the last item is the uh, Walleye Delight, this little. Uh, Ha uh, crawler harness here. Let's go ahead and open it up. You can't appreciate crawler harnesses until you actually rig them up. All right, so let's go ahead and get it out. Usually, uh, at least the guys I know will put live crawlers on these. There we go. All right. I will not unspool that, but basically, you rig up your crawler on there. This will uh, spin as it goes through the water. Right here, it's got little the little wings that are angled to promote that spinning. So probably what I would do is put a swivel uh, ahead of this so that it doesn't twist my line. All right, and then you would put a swivel and maybe some weight ahead of it so that you get it down deep to the walleye. But there you go, that's a walleye, basically your crawler harness. Uh, Saginaw Bay, Lake St. Clair, like I mentioned, St. Mary's River up north. Uh, this thing will be killer. All right. Great for walleye. So there you have it. That is the uh, Walleye Delight Crawler Harness, $3.99. And that's everything in the box. So let's now turn to the value analysis. Like always, I'll bring you along with me. All right. So. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine items in this box, totaling $70.51. Cost on this box was $50. So the added value here was $20.51 or 41% return. Now, guys, 
40% and up is respectable for one of these, you know, regular subscription boxes where they're selling you a lot of um, overstock or maybe discontinued stuff or whatever the case may be. But certainly when you get into a very tailored, very personalized box, to get a 41% return is remarkable. I'll, I'll just tell you because every one of these baits in here, I guarantee you I will use. I'm especially intrigued by uh, this, this bait here. I do want to try that out. But to get some walleye baits, I have to tell you, I appreciate that. Again, because being here in Michigan, um, we do go after walleye and smallmouth bass. So uh, it's not just largemouth. And, and kudos to Vic for being able to, uh, to dial that box in for me. Now, some of you guys might be strictly bass guys, and all you have to do is tell them that. Don't, just tell them, don't send me walleye stuff. I want just bass or whatever. But for me, this was great. I really appreciate this box. And... Uh, uh, I'm very pleased. So, there you have it, guys. 41% on the Florida Tackle Box. I'm sorry, Florida Tackle Club for March 2021. Fantastic. I, um, I have to say thumbs up. I can recommend this box highly to anybody who's interested. So, there you have it. Well, with that, I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up. I'm going to wish each and every one of you a very, very happy Easter. Hopefully, it's peaceful and happy with all of your families uh don't eat too much and uh, as for me i'm going to go get my chores done for today so i can settle down and enjoy the rest of the weekend uh, with that i'm going to go ahead and wrap her up make sure you stop over to that three minute grab bag giveaway and until we meet again ladies and gentlemen take care <laughs> Tanto dicen de borrar mi nafeteye, ya es un mal y de pa' mal y ya...